Hey, hey everybody, it's game time and today I'm opening a box of 2018 Archives of Baseball. This took forever to get here. I had pre-ordered this box and then Topps backed up the release date. Um, you've probably seen videos. I opened some of the retail, which they released that. I think I opened two blaster boxes, but this is my first hobby box. Um, I thought about going ahead and place it when I saw it was actually about to release. I thought about placing a, an order for a second hobby box, but then I slowed my roll and decided I'd, I'd like to check this out first and see what other people are saying, what they're getting as far as their two autographs. Let's see if this is a boom or bust because I'm not really feeling any more bust. Tops is a... Uh, They've put out some good products this year, some really good looking base cards, some interesting sets as far as short prints, and they've they've done a pretty good job on the whole, but there's been some like good products that have crappy autographs. Like um, I really love Stadium Club, but the odds of getting a good autograph are just not that high. Now I personally uh, did have a good pull out of that, but most people most others did not so that's just one example but anyways there are two autos in here so let's see how we do let's see what else we got going on here there are colored parallels silver purple blue gold foil uh there are also looks like short prints logo swap base card variation i will have to check and see what numbers on here are the actual short prints so if i pass one or you see it and you know it's a short print i would much appreciate if you'd let me know in the comments below here's a tyler o'neill rookie and an austin hayes here is a purple parallel elvis andrews this is numbered to 175. Cano and Scherzer. As you probably already know from the retail version, these are, it's uh, I think four different designs. I mean, well, I guess you'd call it reprint. There's a Hank Aaron. I don't know, I guess you could call it design from the different years. Well, my first autograph is a Tommy Timmons from the Sandlot on card autograph. Numbered out of 25. So I'm assuming this is pretty good. I don't know if this is like blue. That's why it's numbered at 25. Because I know the insert, this is a wood grain brown with the regular base insert so interesting cool Tommy Timmons Marte and Molina Zimmerman, Beltre, uh, Garrett Cooper rookie, Simmons, Walker Buehler rookie, Kyle Seeger, Bogarts, and Gordon. Austin Meadows rookie, Keichel, Didi, Will, Piscotti, and a Kevin Apier autograph again on card tops archives uh this, this looks like they just took one from tops archives and put it in here not numbered this time but that should be it for my autographs already unless um unless i get lucky unless the uh tommy timmons was a bonus of some sort we shall see. Gallo, there's a Hicks rookie, Anderson rookie, 
my man Tommy Lasorda, George Brett, Bashers by the Bay, Flaherty Rookie, Fit Rizzuto. Here is a Hamilton Ham Porter Sandlot insert. Here's one of the funnier characters in the movie. But anyways, you can see the difference with the wood grain. There's Bryce Harper and Eddie Matthews. Blackman. There's a Glaber rookie. That's a good one. Turn back the clock. Hank Aaron, Trey Turner, and you. Looks like we've got a silver parallel back there. There's Clayton Kershaw, Nick Williams, rookie, and it is Randy Johnson. Big unit numbered out of 99. Freddie Freeman, JP Crawford, rookie, and Robin Roberts. So that's two parallel, two numbered parallels thus far. There's Aaron Judge, Margot, Rizzo, Flaherty, Bader, and Mayha Cardinals Future Stars rookies. Koufax, it's a good, uh, nice picture of Jimmy Fox. Top rookie history, Dave Winfield. Robles rookie. Corbin and Moncada. There's a Soto rookie. Gary Carter, a oh, really young Gary Carter. Jack Morris, Pedro. Ah, nice. Rookie History Piazza. Although that's not, well, that's a 90, uh, reprint from 93, though. Not exactly his rookie card, but still happy to have that. Reese Hoskins, add that to the PC. Dominic Smith, rookie. I had not looked at the checklist for that insert set. I didn't realize Piazza was in there. Duffy, Correa, Clint Fraser rookie, young Mark McGuire, Andujar rookie, Altuve. Kingery rookie. Ahmed Rosario rookie, McCovey, and a uh, Timmy Timmons Sandlot not autographed. Joe Morgan and Chipper. Larry Wayne. Larry Wayne Jones. Will Clark. Greg Maddox. Uh, McMahon rookie. Turn back the clock. Uh, Conseco. Ernie Banks, there's a Devers rookie, Twin Terrors, Cispidus, and Quato. Here is a Austin Hayes, Cisco, and Scott Future Stars for the Orioles. Braun and Seeger. Beta Rookie. Syndergaard. 
coming attractions Walker Bueller rookie what is this CA2 Trevor Story and Kepler Yasiel Puig Another coming attractions, Radugu, and then Acuna, rookie. That was a good pack. Wade, rookie, and Otani. Dobie, Satchel Page, coming attractions, Acuna. So a couple of those now. A-Rod and John Gray. No more Garcia Parra. DeGrom. Here is a Yankees Future Stars. Glaber, Frazier, and Andujar. Ichiro. Look at that stash. Nice. Just a couple more packs. This is a, a longer break, so that's good. Lots of value here. Plenty of cards, that's for sure. Springer, a Benny the Jet Rodriguez Sandlot. Pollock, Giolito, Coming Attractions, Flaherty, Frank Thomas, Brigman, Cutchen, Strasburg, Space City Standouts, Gohara Rookies, Chancisco Rookie, and our last pack. Dozier, Chessie, turn back the clock. Oh, Ugh, brain fart. Randy Johnson, uh, Gary Sanchez, and Altair. That is it. So, I did end up with just the two, well, the two expected autographs. And I'm suspecting the T uh, Tommy Timmons is pretty good, especially super short print. The Apier, eh. Then ended up with a nice stack of uh, decent rookies. Just, I think, that ended up, if I can pick it up, jeez, always. Um, the two parallels, I think that was it. The purple and silver. I will have to check to see if I did get any short prints. I really won't know the answer to that until I see what the codes on the back say and check through everything. Because I won't be able to spot them. Really happy about that. Some good rookies, the other parallel, and the Glaber. So I think this is pr a pretty solid box from what I can tell. I don't know. I might pick up another one. I'm not sure yet. I'll have to think about it. Let me see. I don't know. And compare it to the retail, I think uh, I did pretty good with the blaster boxes. So I don't know. Maybe I'll pick up some more of those instead. I'm not sure. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. Please like if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button or turn on the alerts if you want to be alerted. I post a video just about every day. And sometimes I post two because I'm a card crackhead. And that's what I do. Thanks for watching. Everybody take care and I'll be back soon.